Hey guys, today Ray and I are gonna show you how we cook sinigang. Sinigang is a sour tamarind based soup dish. So we're gonna start off by throwing in a pound of unripened green tamarinds into a pot, followed by three cups of water. Then boil it for about 10 to 15 minutes. At this point, smash the tamarinds to help release more of the sour juices. Then strain the tamarind liquid into a bowl. Now that we have all the ingredients prepped, start off by placing a rack of ribs into a pot. And then add half a large onion, one large tomato, three cups of water, two and a half teaspoons of salt, and the tamarind liquid. Then boil it on medium heat for 40 minutes. Then, if you want, you can remove the scum that's floating on top of the soup. We like to remove it because it looks gross, but if you don't mind, you can just leave it in there. Next, add in four peeled gabi. Continue to boil for another 30 minutes. You'll want to check if your meat is tender and taste the soup to check if it needs more salt. If everything is good, put in one to two jalapenos and then two bulbs of bok choy. Boil for another 15 minutes. And then bam, you have yourself a sour, savory pot of sinigang. So now the question is, how do you eat it? If you're Filipino, you already know, but if you don't, here's a quick breakdown. Sinigang is always eaten with white rice and is often paired with fish sauce. Not very common, but optional. I like to squeeze a little extra lemon in the fish sauce. You can also drink the soup separately, but most Filipinos will pour it over their rice. So now all you have to do is tear off a piece of meat, take a little bit of fish sauce and some rice, and let's eat! Hope you like this video. If you want to see more videos, make sure to subscribe. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up and let us know how you cook your sinigang.